Section 32 of Republic Act 7920 of the New Electrical Engineering Law. Section 32. Prohibition in the practice of electrical engineering. No person shall a. Practice or offer to practice electrical engineering in the Philippines without having previously obtained a certificate of registration and a professional license from the Board of Electrical Engineering except as provided for in Section 14 hereof. a. Practice of electrical engineering A person is deemed to be in the practice of electrical engineering when he renders or offers to render professional electrical engineering service in the form of 1. Consultation, investigation, valuation, and management of services requiring electrical engineering knowledge. 2. Design and preparation of plans, specifications, and estimates for electric power systems, power plants, power distribution systems including power transformers, transmission lines, and network protection, switchgear, building wiring, electrical machines, equipment and others. 3. Supervision of erection, installation, testing, and commissioning of power plants, substations, transmission lines, industrial plants and others. 4. Supervision of operation and maintenance of electrical equipment in power plants, industrial plants, watercrafts, electric locomotives, and others. 5. Supervision of the manufacture and repair of electrical equipment including switchboards, transformers, generators, motors, apparatus, and others. 6. Teaching of electrical engineering professional subjects, and 7. Taking charge of the sale and distribution of electrical equipment and systems requiring engineering calculations or applications of engineering data. Let us continue with Section 32. Prohibition in the practice of electrical engineering. No person shall b. Use, or attempt to use as his own, certificate of registration, professional license, or the seal of another. c. Give false or forged evidence of any kind to the board or to any member thereof in obtaining a certificate of registration or professional license. D. Falsely impersonate any registrant of like or different name. E. Attempt to use a revoked or suspended certificate of registration or an expired professional license. F. Use, in connection with his name or otherwise assume, use or advertise any title or description tending to convey the impression that he is a professional electrical engineer, registered electrical engineer or registered master electrician without holding a valid certificate or a valid license, and g. Sign a document involving electrical design, plan, technical specification, valuation, and the like on behalf of a professional electrical engineer. Protect our profession. Strengthen our registration. No to non-licensed electrical practitioner.